so today is the next day um so yesterday i bleached the knots on one wig on the wig that i need to highlight the long wig and then i highlighted the curly wig but i didn't bleach the knots so today i was supposed to bleach the knots on that wig and then highlight the other wig but for some reason i cannot find my brush to highlight even though i still i mostly highlight with my hands but still i start with the brush you start right so i cannot find my brush needs a highlight and i'm out of foil so i'm gonna just take the wig home with me and then highlight it at home because i have foil at home but um we got the highlight i mean we got the knots bleached i had a client this morning finished that i have more wigs than clients and i'm okay with that I, i'm okay with that but um i do more wigs than people most days so um it'll be one or two people come through and then i'll be spending the rest of my time on wigs so right now I'm recurling one of my ready to ship units because um, I had it for a minute, but I always like to refresh it every once in a while, um, get new pictures, get new videos and stuff like that. So somebody actually inquired about this wig and I'm not gonna have nobody pull up in my wigs looking crazy. We not doing that. So we gonna um, curl it up just in case she does come through. And then even if she doesn't, I'm probably gonna do some content with it just so we can try to get this one sold. And it's so pretty. I don't understand why people sleep on this girl, but what is? So we doing that. Um, I gotta rinse the knots off the other wig soon because both of these wigs need to go out Monday. Um, yeah. So we just getting this one curl. Let me let me rinse the knots on the other one. Then I'm gonna get y'all better adjusted so we can curl this wig. All right, so we got that. The knots on that wig rinsed off. So now it's sitting in some um, condition. Well, I got the purple shampoo sitting on the knots so we can tone it. And then we'll rinse it out and let it air dry because it's curly hair and it just looks better when it drip dry. It just, it set better to me. So, well, no, I gotta bleach the knot. I gotta, we're not done. Anyway, um, it's sitting in the purple shampoo. Um, but I'm gonna finish curling this one. I let that sit probably 10 minutes, if if 10, because it's been sitting for like three already. So let that sit for a few minutes, then we're going to finish curling this one. And then I got my, my, my one of my mannequins came down because they so tall. I'm tall. I'm six foot tall. Well, I'm probably living in real life, but I'm six foot tall. I'm tall. Um so but they so high i still can't reach them without the ladder and one day i caught myself trying to get a wig down and didn't want to get the ladder knowing i need the ladder and then pull my thing down off the wall but i'll put it back i'll put it back well actually the the cleaning people swept up one of my screws that's why i ain't put it back already so now i gotta find a screw to put it so i can put it back and then my um wigs that was up there my display wigs have been selling so that's great but my, my um, display looking a little naked so i'm happy i got uh over here i keep my unfinished wigs on the um uh rack over here on the side so i gotta finish some of those so i can fill refill my display my display wall but i'm using a one inch barrel curl to curl these this had a clamp on it this is my favorite curler. This is a Babyliss um, Babyliss Pro Graphite Titanium One. It's a curler. It was like a set or whatever. But I, I somehow I broke. I think I dropped it because I'm kind of clumsy, so that's the thing. But whatever. Uh, I dropped it and broke off the um, the clamp. Like a piece of it came off like the screw started getting loose and the screw came off so i didn't want to give up my curler so i took the clamp off and just used it like a wand because if you ever did like flat wand curls it's so cute so i feel like it'll still do what i needed to do i can't remember i can't remember if i ever use it like that but we'll see when i finish this when i finish this week how it come out but i guess i'm gonna go ahead and put you out in the time lapse because I don't feel like talking the whole time. Do a time lapse so we can go ahead and get through this one. And on me.
Intuition has been telling you Things that you never knew Rubbing his shoulders with bitches I used to put on pedestals Just gotta keep it professional Laying in the bed and you acting like I can't even touch you I don't know I just wanna know what y'all be with this honey wig Because she is flawless Now this is a medium This is not my size I wear a size large So it doesn't sit, you know, the best on my head But Lace plug to perfection I already got baby hair. I already got the little sidebinds again. This is not my head size, so it doesn't sit right on my head, but it would sit, you know, perfect. And she is gorgeous. I'm trying to understand, like, what y'all be for her? It's a 24 inch layered, custom colored. It's a, a, a a uh, light brown well not light brown but it's like a warm brown with the blonde highlights with the honey blonde highlights this color always give me like 2014 like if you know you know like peak youtube girlies she gorgeous i don't understand the, what's the issue i don't get it i don't get it she gonna eat every time Every single time. Amazon says like 475 right now. Gorgeous. If you know, like I know, you need to snag her, okay? Okay, size medium, middle part. Beautiful. Hey y'all, okay, so it is Monday. Um, I did take the long, the Chanel wig, it was the long um, highlight wig. I took the Chanel unit home and I did highlight that at home um, and I deep conditioned it overnight. So it's currently in the dryer. I finished the JC unit on um, Friday. So the only thing I gotta do today is just pluck the hairline and she wanted baby hairs in that unit. So pluck the hairline, give her some baby hair and um, she'll be ready to be packaged up. And the other one, I just need to pluck the hairline and flat iron. So we gonna get that done today. And then somebody is coming to pick up the honey unit this afternoon. So we gonna go ahead and box that up as well and box those two up so we can get them out to the post office. Okay, so this is the JC unit. It's um, a deep curly wig with highlights in it. So we just gotta go and customize it. And get her ready. Uh, so yeah, we gonna do that now. And on me, holding me closer than we've ever been before. This ain't a dream. You're here with me, boy. It don't get no better than you. Do you? For you, I wanna take my time all night, baby. You should let me love you. Let me be. Good love and 
All right, so we got all the units colored. Um, I just gotta get this one straightened and packed away. It is currently three ten, three ten, and I just need to get this one straightened um, and plugged and in the mail by five o'clock. Um, but I do have a client that is coming to pick up the honey unit and she coming to pick that up right now. So I'm gonna put this to the side and curl a piece of the honey unit. When I was coming through it, I uncurled it, curl a piece of the honey unit. I'm gonna text that extra shoot me to box it up. And if we need to, we'll box it up for her and get this ready. This will go inside the box. Uh. And this is just a tissue paper I got from Target. I used to buy my tissue paper in bulk, but I ran out, so I just went and got a bunch of this, and I'm gonna use this till it's gone. It's white with just gold polka dots on it. And this is our so extra extensions with the gold foil, and it's textured. Let me see if you can you see the texture on the box it's textured and then it says add a little extra with so extra extensions and then inside of the box it says send us your selfie and then hashtag so extra selfie hashtag so extra extensions and on the back is our social media and website information so i'm gonna go ahead and lay this inside the box like that and then add the gift inside so I'll just be needing to place the wig in when when it's ready. All right, so this is the honey unit, all fully curled and ready to go. I'm gonna leave it out just so she can see it when she pick it up and then we'll box it up while she's here. But she is cute and she is done. So now I gotta move her and then get back to the Chanel unit. customer than the one that I said inquired about the honey unit. And girl, why both of the clients show up here at the same time to buy wig? I mean, they were, they were seconds apart. Seconds. So, like, um, girl, I just was so bad because I don't be liking it. I don't be liking it, but they showed up seconds apart to get the same wig. So, the person who got here first bought the wig, and then the person who got here after her just 
put a custom order in for the same, like for me to recolor the same unit, reprocess the same unit. So we go ahead and got that done for her. Our custom order process takes seven to 14 business days. Um, usually I try to keep it on the, you know, the lower side of that spectrum, but if necessary, I got the time just in case. But I, I, I feel so bad because, uh-uh, I just, oh, I hurt this one. I don't know, but yeah, so, but that took time because I had cut the lace for one, the first lady, and then I had to do the measurements for the second one. So, since she was getting a custom unit, we had to go ahead and get her measurements and everything squared away. I lost my brush. But, only thing I have to do with this unit is just finish straightening it. And I gotta pluck the hairline, but luckily she don't want baby hair on this wig, so it ain't gonna take nothing crazy, hopefully. I ain't gonna rush it though. I, I don't, I ain't rushing. If we don't get it done, we don't get it done. I'm not gonna rush my hair, babe. But luckily I am, um, and luckily this is just what I'm doing. Um, I'm gonna upgrade both of these units to priority shipping just as a customer service thing because this customer's issue, her order got held up in um, the holiday traffic twice. So she ordered right before Christmas and then um, I didn't have the hair on hand that I needed to make her week, so I had to order it from my vendor and it got caught in Christmas lag and it was a weekend. So um, it got caught in that shipping. And then once it got to the US, it, well, no, it got caught in the processing because my bed is closed for Christmas. So when I placed the order, it did. I had another order that needed to be customized, like the textures and stuff needs to be customized. So this, her hair had to wait with that order. And then um, once they finally shipped it out, it got shipped out and got caught with New Year's traffic. So she been waiting on her. And, um, I don't play that. So we gonna go ahead and overnight it. So she needed by Friday. So just in case I don't make it tonight, then we'll have it to her still by Friday. Came back to the shop to get the packages that I need to get sent out today. Hey y'all, so it's Jamaica. I'm coming in a few days later just to end off this vlog. My phone kept running out of storage, so it kept stopping in the middle of my videos. And I, I'm so sorry. I had ordered a, a USB drive from Amazon to transfer my files from my phone to my computer to free up some space so we won't have the issue in the future. But I'm gonna end up this vlog right here. Um, I do apologize for skipping around and things like that. I did get the packages sent out and Houston being Houston, it didn't get sent out on time, but luckily my customer received her week yesterday that she needed by today. She's going to a ball, so um, hopefully she'll send me pictures and stuff like that of her with the wig on and my other customer got her wig today as well um and yeah i hope you enjoy hope to see y'all again like share subscribe and i'll check in with y'all next week Baby, the sound of you.